Space Force and the mighty empire of Crow Prime. May our alliance last for a thousand years. Crow Prime. Proudly serving mercenaries from across the quadrant. Keeping it real up here on Luna. The Moroni 5 Lounge is open for military, non-military, paramilitary, quasi-military, and all personnel in between. Come relax with us. Take a load off. It's only one sixth Earth's gravity up here. Tempting. Just dial Elon Musk 800. Now they do have tours. I know it's kind of a tough time down there on Terra. Travel is a little problematic. But remember, you need aerosols to spread COVID. We don't have aerosols up here on Luna. We do have the space virus. That's a different thing. And uh, we're working on that. We have an anti-tentacle serum to remove those unsightly space virus tentacles. Uh, but that's something that tourists really don't have to worry about. So come on down, or up, or over, and join us at the Moroni Farm Lounge, located on level three of Space Force Moon Base. All right, let's have some music. What do we got, what do we got tonight? We're gonna get funky on the airwaves. It's a party <laughs> in our mind. It's a party in the mind. Get the groove going for a minute. It's been a tough week. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
oxygen up here so we've got to get it flowing. Michael Vasquez, Aaron Arnold, welcome. Early bird special. Guess I'm gonna get right to it. We got a new sponsor. I don't I don't make the rules, I just enforce them, as they say on earth. Anyway, our drink special tonight. Mmm. To celebrate and inaugurate the uh, historic uh, strategic alliance between the Space Force and uh, the uh, Empire of Krull Prime, we have uh, this special brew. It's, it's a um, aged, chilled blood wine from Krull Prime. The blood wine of Krull Prime. Mmm, that's Got a nice metallic tang to it. I'm not sure whose blood it was, but they did a nice job with it. Anyway, we're gonna be seeing a lot more of this chilled blood wine from Krull Prime, I believe, as the uh, historic alliance between Space Force and Krull Prime progresses apace. Well, I guess I'll be drinking my fill of this. Anyway, Special tonight, stop on over, Moroni 5 Lounge. Blood wine, it's what's for dinner. Mmm. <sighs> yeah. That's kind of a invigorating for the night owls, if you get my, catch my drift. All right, we're gonna move right on now. Anybody else wanna check in, say hi? We've had a busy week down there on Terra, I know. There's all kinds of um, activities going on. <laughs> remember, I forget what I was gonna say, but remember to think about the things that you wanna say before you forget them. Otherwise, they're gone. I was gonna say something about civic involvement, participatory democracy, something like that, I forget. But the idea was, you know, Speak now or forever hold your peace, that kind of thing. Anyway, moving right along. Here's a new number. You are not authorized. Ha <laughs> ha, hold you. You are not authorized. You are not authorized. You are not authorized. You are not authorized to. You, you are not authorized. I'm, you are not authorized. I'm going to be authorized one of these days. But until then, let's just, let's just, let's just agree to disagree. Can we do that? Can we just agree to disagree?
get yourself out of that gravity well, you know, that mental gravity well that takes you over day by day, hour by hour. It gets harder and harder, but you got to blast off. And that's what it's all about here. Space Force Jazz Lounge. We're taking you out of your gravity well, getting you somewhere else so you can see, see the heavens clearly, or at least the view screen of your choice. The view screen of your choice, but you got to get out of that gravity well to do it. Anyway, I hope all is well. Uh, I'm, as always, experimenting with this technology. We're in improving daily, if not hourly, minutely, you might say, trying to bring the highest quality programming to you that we can within our budgetary limits here at the Moroni 5 Lounge. Anyway, it's a, it's a brand new week here. I think it's time for another sip of the, uh, the old uh, chilled blood wine from good old Roll Prime. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, it makes you want to toast. I don't have a skull of my enemies. I think we have to order those special. Yeah, look in your catalog under skull. Skull drinks, but skull of your enemies and drink your chilled blood wine from the from Crawl Prime. You know, it's a patriotic thing to do. Now that we're in an alliance, I'm the last to know. I'm just an entertainer. What can I say? Moving right along. Let's see what we got. Oh, yeah. This goes out to the Indian Space Program. As always, our partners in the sky. <coughs> Thank you. 
tune there on Terra. Are we broadcasting? Is all well? I can't tell. All systems look nominal. If you happen to be there, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down or some kind of an icon or, you know, a symbol, a sign. Just give me a sign. Just give me a sign. And we keep going. Speaking of sign, you know what rhymes with sign? Chill blood wine. Mmm, mmm. I'm developing taste for it. Makes me kind of aggressive. Mmm. Chilled blood wine from the mercenary empire of Crow Prime. You know, it's a job. <sighs> Mercenaries, you know, they're for hire. All right, moving right along. Let's see what's on my list now. Mmm. This is one of my favorites. Moon Base Stopover. You find yourself, you took a trip, and it didn't go the way you thought. Your trajectory became misaligned. External factors caused a shift in trajectory. You might find yourself in Moon Base. That's where we come in. We welcome the travelers, the lost, psychologically confused, philosophically disoriented. Come on down. That's what we're all about.
far as I know. At least my simulacrum is communicating with your avatar and our messages are unambiguously digitized and preserved for the record. So we got that going for us. I hope everybody's been having a good week. I don't know what to report except we keep going. We keep going. I'm working on some uh, new um, interplanetary projects. I'm very excited and hopefully by next week we will have some, some more um, musical collaborations between us up here on Luna and y'all down there on Terra. But the creative energies cannot be separated by hundreds of thousands of miles of, of vacuum. We can overcome those slight difficulties, that the distances that separate us through our indomitable, indomitable creative spirit. Uh, speaking of which, it's time once again to shill for our corporate sponsors. This is actually, um, we're celebrating a strategic uh, alliance between the mercenary planet of the Krull Prime Empire, whatever, you know, but it's just what it says on their business card. Krull Prime and their drink, their specialty, which they have offered us at a high discount, a low discount, is the um, chilled blood wine. And you know, after, if you get over the moral ambiguities of drinking somebody's blood that's been fermented, it's really not bad. It's sort of like all drinks are supposed to do. It, it cuts away all doubt. It eradicates any kind of moral ambiguities that make you think maybe I shouldn't. A few more sips and you go, I'm gonna. I thought about maybe I shouldn't. I'm gonna. Mm -mm. Chilled blood wine from Krull Prime. All right. Available soon at a commissary near you. All right, well, I'm not hearing anything, so I'm just gonna keep on keeping on. However, as you know, stay in touch. Email me, pksaxhq at gmail.com, or just check the Google. Go to the website, pksax.com. Stay in touch, we've got a weekly newsletter. We've got all kinds of interplanetary shenanigans going on. And uh, we'd like to have you be part of the action. All right. Meanwhile, oh, yeah. this is nice. This is a little number called A Thousand Points of Laser Light.
I see in my feed. What is that? What is this I see in my feed? I don't know what that is. It's a feed. Somebody's feeding me something. Jimmy. <laughs> uh, I'll take it. TC. Oh, it's good to see people. Yes. I'm, I'm such a Luddite, which is kind of ironic because I've got this gig in a very high technology situation in which any mistake could result in certain death. You know, it's like, I, I didn't sign up for that, but I did sign up for it. I just didn't really realize it. I might have been drinking. Speaking of which, time for a little sip of this good old, you know, those crawl prime mercenaries get a bad rap. You know, I have a few sips of this blood wine. You know, everybody's gotta make a living, so what? You just, just don't look them in the eye. Just don't make eye contact with the mercenaries. Be cool. As they say down on earth, if you've done nothing wrong, you have nothing to worry about, right? <laughs> Just don't look them in the eye. Just gonna keep your head down and have a nice glass of chilled blood wine from the Kroll Prime Empire. Hmm. You know somebody's doing something right over there. Mm -hmm. Of course, it would taste better if you could drink it out of the skull of your enemy, I know that's the traditional way. We've got some other Kroll Prime artifacts, we'll bring that in a little later, but uh, if you don't have the skull of your enemy, you can get a replica on Amazon Galactic, I believe, and uh, I recommend the uh, blood wine drunk from at least a replica of the skull of your enemy. But having said all that, what was I talking about before I so rudely interrupted myself? I was saying that a Luddite such as myself has trouble with basic technology. I can't even tell who is, um, who is on with me. Oh, Tommy. Okay, I see. I just have to stick my finger in it. <laughs> uh, stick my finger in it, and then it responds. Uh, I guess I should read the instruction manual, maybe. But anyway, I'm learning. Just, um, you know, up here on Luna, don't go outside without your complete atmosphere suit on. I know you've got a similar situation on Terra these days. Don't go outside without your atmosphere suit on. Uh, otherwise, let's just have a good time. Moving right along. Here we go. Let's see, what's the name of this next one? That was, that was a one called, that was a little nostalgic number called A Thousand Points of Laser Lights. You get it, you remember? Back in the day, those slogans people used to throw around optimistic slogans, but don't look directly at the lasers, those thousand points of laser light. Could cause retina damage. All right, meanwhile, we're gonna do our tribute to the belt mining peoples. Those peoples, you know who you are, the essential workers who are out there in the asteroid belt getting the, mer the materials, the rare earths and metals and all that that we need for our devices. Ah. This goes out to y'all. Mm -hmm.
that groove going down there. I know you got five, six more gravity pulling you down psychically, pressing you down. But don't give in to that. Imagine yourself up here floating on Luna. We may not have much going on except our imagination. But we got one sixth of gravity. It makes me a little lighthearted. Shout out to everybody that's checking in. Let's see if I can work this technology. I think I just stick my finger in. Yeah, Mitch. Lois. Yes, I'm sticking my finger in and moving it around and hopefully it has some results. Miles, I'm sticking my finger right on your icon. Can you feel me touching your icon? Psychically, Len, I am touching all of your icons with my finger. Robert, but in the best way. You know, friend to friend. All right, let's get down. Yes, this is called The Sands of Mars. It goes out to all the UAE folks out there.
finger on the pulse on the pulse of Facebook. I'm sticking my finger right into Facebook. Ah, right into Facebook. Oh, and I'm moving it around. Can you feel me, Facebook? Can you feel my finger? such a good time. Party vibe, says CC. Yes, I'm losing my mind. Having such a good time. So it must be time for some chilled blood wine from the Empire of Crow Prime. Mm. Somebody gave up their blood to make a delicious, tasty beverage. You know, we're all in it together. We all serve a purpose. Even my enemies, because they provide the skull from which I drink my blood wine. I'm just paraphrasing, really. It's all in the tourist brochure if you want to take a trip to the uh, Kroll Prime Empire. <clears throat> you know, see the mercenaries when they're off duty. They know how to party. <clears throat> all right. Wow, we only got a few more minutes. I'm going to stick my finger back in it, see who's around. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's see. Mmm. Paul Hockey, good to have you here. You're not just out on the farm milking the cows. You know that joke. 
You darn fool, we don't have cows, we only have a bull. Out there on the farm. Goes out to you, Texas. All right, moving right along, we still got a lot of material. And that was, uh, woof, 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 woof. That was a little space ecstasy, Elon Musk fans. A little space ecstasy. And uh, now, here's a little love song. It's about that's what they call in French, uh, cet obscur objet du désir, or cet objet du désir obscur, that, that obscure object of desire, that hidden, unfathomable, unknowable, and yet you want it, you want it so bad. Ah, so it goes out to that. It's called Amour étrange. Take it back. Sorry, I got hurt myself. This is called the cave, Caves of Luna. It's a little more mysterious. We'll get to the Amour Etonge in a minute. Let's get back to basics.
blood wine. Drinking from the skull of your enemy. Yeah, see? And hold your ceremonial dagger while you drink it. It's a little complicated. Got my chilled blood wine, my ceremonial dagger. Ooh, I feel better already. I'm sticking my finger on you, Wilson, but in a friendly way. I'm just scrolling. Just scrolling. Lori. Lori and Tracy. I'm just scrolling. Nothing personal. <laughs> yes. Yes, I am scrolling my finger on the mighty entry point of Facebook. Facebook. Scrolling. All right, meanwhile, one more sip of this delicious chilled blood wine from the empire of Kroll Prime. Our new Alliance partners, Space Force, as we move out past the solar system into reaches of the galaxy, choices must be made. Alliances, you can't make a space omelet without breaking space eggs, as they say. Mm-hmm. All right, let's keep it going a little bit longer. Let's get metaphysical. In the caverns of Luna. presence is felt, and yet it comes from within. The alien presence is within. You, you are the alien presence. Your ego is merely a mask that you wear for protection. Wear your mask for protection. 
protection, protect your ego. But inside, there is an alien presence, and you feel it. Do you choose to fight it? Fight it! Fight it! Or do you accept it? inside you. You must find it as a symbiotic. It's not a parasite. It's not an other. It is part of you. It feels like an alien presence. And yet, it is symbiont. It is symbiont. It is part of you. You are not one entity, but a unified assembly. That's the way I see it. 
up here on Luna. Works for me. Anyway, hope you've been having a good time. I'm Commander PK, broadcasting every week from the fabulous Moroni 5 Lounge, located deep on level three, Moon Base, Space Force Moon Base. Now, in a strategic alliance with the Empire of Paul Prime. Security. This gives you a feeling of security, having security, doesn't it? Do you feel more secure knowing that there's more security? Just a question I ask myself as I try to drift off after another full day of existential crisis. That's life. As they say on Earth, beats the alternative. All right, y'all, let's play a song out. Peace.